What's up guys, this is D, the Grim Gamer. For the YouTube viewers, if you want to skip right ahead to the gameplay, there will be a timestamp in the description box below for you. As for the rest of you, welcome back for another Thursday night stream on the channel where I scour the graveyards of the gaming world and resurrect old titles and give them one more shot at life. We have resurrected the rotting corpse of Ragnar the Viking for Rune Viking Warlord. We got an original copy for the PlayStation 2 and even broke out the Fat Boy PS2 for this. Uh, and so far, we've got through like 12 levels of like 60. <laughs> There's a long way to go. As far as uh, as far as this journey is concerned, uh, still taking this uh, just one night uh, at a time. So, see, we got some uh, some some of y'all jumping in. I appreciate the hell out of you for that, evolving fetus. How you doing? Top of the mornings to you over there. It's uh, pretty late for us over here. Lurk, thanks for jumping in. What's up, Suave? Yeah, yeah, he's kind of, you know. So this game, this was what, 2000? Well, the original PC version was 2000. So uh, Skyrim came out in what, 2011, I think it was? So Ragnar the Viking, uh, you know, was rocking that uh, uh, helmet choice um, about a decade early <laughs> compared to, uh, compared to uh, the Dragonborn. Uh, Suave, dropping the Discord link in there for y'all. Appreciate you, because uh, anybody who hasn't done so already, and these fine gentlemen that are in the chat, well, and then there's Squirrel on top of it, Squirrels Gaming 83 how you doing, what's up, guys? So, uh, what I was about to say, that uh, Discord server there, for those of you that don't know, or haven't done so already, all these fine gentlemen in the chat have already done so, but if you'd like to join all of them... And join us for some more gaming content, which, let's face it, everybody needs more gaming content in their lives. Then you're going to want to check out that Discord. That is the Grim Beardson Discord. That is a joint Discord server amongst uh, myself and my brother, Suave Beardson, who is there in the chat. You can chat with us all week long. You can see the stream schedules for Suave and myself of what we plan on streaming next and on which days and there are links to our various YouTube channels as well where uh, you can see all of our um, streaming um, archives and uh, along with some uh, original content on the channels that you will not find on Twitch so we're gonna jump back into this again this is a uh, rune Viking warlord this is part two of what I intend on being a uh, full playthrough. So grab your drinking horns and let's get started. Ah, yeah. There we go. All right. Let's do it. That's right. We've got a year-long loading screen anyway, so this is going to take a moment. Should have done this a second ago. Yeah, I figure it probably would be a little on the impractical side. I mean, from the stuff that we see in the TV shows and all that stuff, right? The Vikings were known for that whole shield wall thing. Um, how practical would it be you got these horns off the side of your helmet, right? And he's like, shield wall, turn, you poke out your boy's eye or something, you know? Wouldn't be a good time, you know? Kind of leave a, a hole in your buddy's head and in the line of your defense. It's bad all the way around. <laughs> Not practical at all. So, uh, Squirrel, Evolving Fetus, Lurk, Suave, what's, what have you guys all been up to as of late? You see what I'm doing? I'm waiting on loading screens. <laughs> there we go. Well, at least I thought. Hold on, give it a second. Here we go. All right, so here's... Uh, Here's our boy Ragnar. We got several different weapons. Mace. We got a couple different... Uh... I did not mean to throw my sword. We want. We might want to hold on to that. 
So this is a Roman sword. But I got multiple swords that I can switch in between. And even with my axes, I believe... Well, I thought I had a couple different axes. That must not be a thing. So, um, yeah, that is what it is. Man, I don't care what anybody says. That Metal Gear Delta looks sweet. Um, might be looking into trying to get me a copy of that. I know Suave's going to want it day one, but I might be trying to join him in that. Oh, we got a cutscene here? Many are sent to hell, young warrior, but I allow none to escape. Is that so? Well, there's a lot of screaming and agony going around. I mean, that's uh, par for the course. I mean, we in hell, so. Well, you know, seems like. Oh, hey, what up? We've uh, we've talked about this many times, Suave. It's you know, gamers these days, you just can't appease everybody, right? Somebody's got to complain about something, and I swear, some of the complaints these days for some of these games is just so that people are like trolling other people. I swear that's all it is. It's all it feels like some of the time because it's like your complaints sound extremely stupid, you know. So I feel like some people just do that just to rile up other people. Get out of here. People complain now? Oh, people complain. And some of it is quite hilarious. Alright. Um... Sure, just mow that down. And death. Just lob his head off. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. He's donezo. Yeah, and, um, you know, I don't want to get into a whole conversation about stuff like this, but... Negative stuff like that, right? It, it trends faster than positive stuff. So you just see more of the negative than you do the positive. Just kind of the way it is. I ate a leg of meat! You know, so that's just, you know, that's just what you're going to see, you know? Lob your head off quick. And yours... Ooh, rune of bloodlust, but there's no enemies to take out my... Oh, here's one. Come on down. Ooh, that one-shot kill right there. Can't get up there apparently, so that's uh, that's cool. I mean, yeah. Why would you complain necessarily? You know, about a one-to-one -one remake because that's you're just you're updating a game that was you know it's iconic to begin with. If it wasn't so beloved, it would have been long forgotten about, and. Uh, it wouldn't be getting a remake to start with, so, um, why change any of it? Hey, Tekkit, how you doing? Good to see ya. Yeah, doing alright. Uh, making my way through hell here, you know. The good stuff. There was a... Yeah, there it is. My lizard to get my health back up. Oh, another one of you, huh? Come on down. Wow. I'm betting these guys just keep coming. I'm guessing is how that works. 
So, we probably just have to move on, I'm guessing. Is what's gotta happen here. Nothing there. Alright, that's cool. Off with they heads! Alright, um... Not sure where I'm going at this point, but... Oh, there's a door I can go in, so what about this way? Is there anything this way? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. Alright. Joe... Joe who? Apparently I don't. I've I don't think I've ever heard that name before. And if I have, I am not familiar with it. Well, I guess there was nothing up there for me. Oh boy. Well this uh this looks fun. Oh, it looks like I can go down here. Alright. Some runes over there. Um, I haven't been paying attention to any TNA nor NXT, so yeah, I have no idea who that is. Alright, where am I supposed to go now? That is the next question. Here? Uh, well, I guess that I guess that works. You sir are fired. Look, man, it just, it's, a lot of it's just not interesting to me anymore. I'm on fire! I guess that's how we'll do that. Oh! Is that my master sword? <laughs> my viking sword? Well, I've seen some lizards over here. We're gonna want those. Alright. We go fight now. I, I did forget the red tunic. You're completely right. Don't think I need it. Just lob their heads right off in one shot, yeah? And it's a Roman sword anyway, which I already had, so that was a complete waste. It's alright. Give me all the lizards. All the lizards. Uh, let's see. Well, that makes sense. You know, be able to pay attention to, you know... Oh, well that's uh that's the end of that level guys. We're uh, we're getting we're making progress. Check that out. Um no, that makes sense with the IWR and TNA like crossover basically what's going on there. A lot of guys work for that. That makes sense. So that was the realm of hunger. So we uh we moving on. Yeah, that Roman sword wasn't good enough. I wanted the other Roman sword. <laughs> All right, so I, I tried to look up a level list for this game. Could only find one for the PC version, and the PC version and the PS2 version uh, are different. Uh, so I I had to do some things in order to like put together a level list, and the amount of levels that were in this game kind of blew me away. Um, uh, yes, yes I do. Um, I like it quite a bit. It's quite fancy. <laughs> and it holds quite a bit, too, which I like. Um, but yeah, the, like, came up with, um... Let me bring that back up here. Six... Uh, no, excuse me. Seventy levels uh, to this game. So it's a lot. 
Um, so we got, uh, I got my work cut out for me here to really make that some progress. Do not welcome the presence of the living warrior. You remind them of all they have lost. And though you may be strong, their numbers will take their toll. Eventually. Is that right? Uh, yeah, 70. That's, uh, now... I say 70 levels, but the, here's the thing. It's not actually 70 levels. It comes down to like 70 save points. Um, so in between levels, but then even the cutscenes, um, like just because the way the game like must be coded or um, designed or something, um, that even when there is a cutscene, You'll have a save point, you'll see the cutscene, then there's another save point. So, I don't know how many of that are, like, cutscenes and that sort of thing either. Um, but it's the only way that I could figure out uh, a level list, basically. Um, I'll just walk through this cage. It's cool, right, guys? Oh, no, he actually won't drop down, though. Um, can't walk through the cage, negative review on Steam. I can't imagine walking through the fire would be a smart choice. Oh, that is a, uh, that is a platform. I was expecting this to be shorter, too. Oh, oh, here we go. Oh, hell no. Whatever the hell you are. Come on. I was say, come on, pop up here, skeleton, but no, you wanna, you wanna stay dead. That's cool. Um... Oh, hey, what up, skeleton? Get out of here. Alrighty. Uh, got a couple lizards there, so we got food. That's good to know. Might need them lizards now. <laughs> Chow down. All right. Um, assuming. Okay, well, you're a door. Uh, you are nothing yet. Uh, no, I am using uh, an actual PS2 version. Um, uh, copy with the Fat Boy PS2. Um, now again, this is originally a PC game. This version that I'm playing was ported after the fact. This was originally released in 2000 on PC. You might be able to find this on Steam, potentially. On Steam, okay. Yeah, I kind of figured as much. Lizard? That must be the same type of sword I've already got. Rune Classic? Well, that makes sense. Say, I can get up here, but there's no reason for me to. So that's... That's neat. <laughs> Leave a negative review for the PS2 version <laughs> on Steam. Yeah, sure, why not? Some of the PS2 stuff added in. So I don't know what was changed or what was, like, added um, for the PS2 version because I've never played the original. Um... 
But apparently, from what I had read, um, there was a couple extra maps and a couple different enemies uh, that were added for this version. But other than that, it was pretty much the exact same game. I don't know how true that is, that's just what I read. Oh, that's my that's my gate from over here. Right? Uh no. Indeed not. Wait, ho hold on. No, down. There must be another lever that I'm not that I'm not seeing. Ah. Aha. Yeah. So, there's that. There we are. All right, Ragnar, we're going places. Whoa, hello, fire breath. Yo. All right, now I am, whoa, getting a little on the confused side. Not 100% sure where I'm supposed to be going now. And there is a lot of doors. And these ones are leading to nothing. We got Draugr! <laughs> Off with the head! Oh, that was a swell shot. Yes, I said swell. Look at them trying to use traps on me. And running into their own traps. What a bunch of idiots. Alright. Uh... <laughs> stole everything from Skyrim again this was like a decade before Skyrim though Skyrim stole everything from this oh that must have been the end of the level cool guys we're uh, we're moving right on I like how it just abruptly ends in mid fall to go hey do you want to save your game now it's probably about time don't you think it's, uh, hell's engine no I know that <laughs> But hey, even if they did, right? Props to them for taking this and making it to something that's still being played over a decade later. Nobody's playing this. Let's not kid ourselves. Nobody but, you know, somebody like me who picks up cheap-ass games at a, a game store for six bucks and go, huh, wonder what this is all about. Time machine, actually. Yeah. He um, he was in the development phases for this. Like, you know what? They are butchering this. I'll give it about another decade, and uh, we'll re-release it as um, something else. They won't even know, guys. It's cool. It's fine. You know, not a big deal. Yeah, I like how it's got to save, then it's got to load, then it's got to, like, load some more. Alright. Ate a lizard. Eat all the lizards. Alright, so we got a couple. Okay, that shuts that off. That shuts that off. Open sesame. All right, lightning bolts. Go. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> Are you like loading? So we added loading screens to your loading screens. Yeah, a lot of that going on right now.
Oh, come on. There we go. Yeah, they basically gave them the blueprint for Skyrim with this. Oh, now we've got uh, traps and things. Hey, guys, you want to just run into those traps? That would be swell. Yeah, just kind of like that. You just keep doing your thing, guys. Yeah, I like it. No, come on. No, come this way. Glitching the hell out over there. Yeah, just like that. That works. Yeah, all of that was just fine. I did not think that that was anywhere near me, thank you very much, but that's cool. Why you don't wear the helm from the intro screen? No, I don't think they forget. I think as you progress through the game, his appearance changes. Um, but this is still pretty early on yet. Um, as I, I think from the opening scene to now, he's already changed his appearance once. So... Yeah, no, I think I got gypped because I, I'm i going to have to go back and watch that. I don't feel like them blades were anywhere near me. I, I, don't, I don't think so. That doesn't seem right. I think I, I thought that uh, I was um, getting by them quite quite well, I think. Yeah, he's, he's not the dragonborn yet. Exactly. He's not Fosro dying yet. He's just dying, apparently. Let's try this again. I like how his eating, uh, his eating motion is basically to pick it up and just chuck it over his shoulder. Bye. There was a leg of meat that I didn't see, so that's cool. Severed head, I don't need. There we go. I need to hit the button. All right, and then the blade's gone, so that's uh, that's neat. No, come here. Let me let me grab this right here. Oh yeah, rune of bloodlust. Get the hell out of here, son. Come here. Come here. Berserker mode. Yeah, something like that. Now, that was this room. This other room was right here, the one that I supposedly died in, right? That was this one? Yeah. Yeah, you guys are doing a great job protecting whatever it is I'm not supposed to get to. <laughs> All right. Not a fan of this camera angle at the moment, but... No, oh, sure, I'll eat the lizard. There. There we go. Yeah. You're all doing a wonderful job! Yeah. Oh, this first person mode sucks. You don't even get to see him swinging the weapon! That's dumb. 
Come on, animators. You couldn't have put, like, just a one single arm in a, a sword animation? Really? Really? Uh, yeah, it's, uh... You can call it that. <laughs> um... The control scheme... Actually, let me say this. You can pick from, like, three or... F no. Four or five different control schemes. Um, none of which I liked. So I just had to stick with the original one and just try to make it work. Um, running around isn't too terrible. Except for, like, you know, turning. Look, he don't even have a turn animation. It's just... <laughs> just... It's not great. Um... The, the combat doesn't feel all that satisfying. I'll be completely honest about that. Um, the... To attack is um, R1, to block is R2, which I cannot stand. But if I wanted to change the control scheme, then, you know, to try to get it to where just those two buttons, like R1 would be attack, and then like L1 would be block, then all of his movements would be done off of one joystick instead of, you know, movement and then turning and looking on the other, which I didn't like. It's just, it's all, it's all types of bad. All right, let's see here. Got it. The developers of this were a group called uh, Human Head Studios. And this was the first game they ever made. Now... Oh, hold on. Something's happening here. Well, I shut off all the things, so what does that mean? Oh, mean stuff's breaking. That's that's what that means. Okay, so I got some chains to climb up there, so that's a thing. Oh, and then we got more of the hellhounds. We'll call them. Now that hole is uh, well over there. Um, but yeah, it was Human Head Studios. It was the first game they ever made, but they would go on later to make other games, at least, that I've heard of. One was Brink. One was, um... Oh, what the hell was that other one? Uh, A Quiet Man. I think they did that one. Um, but they're not around anymore. This port was actually handled by Take-Two Interactive. Um... So I found that kind of neat. There we go. You just fall over dead? Well, uh, that was cool, I guess. Yeah, there were a couple that I heard of. Oh, are those my, uh... Yep, that's my... Sunken log, uh, long ship. There are many you know in my realm. And my Perhaps companions. You might even find your father among the dishonored souls you slay with such abandon. Hmm. All right, so we got a couple things that we have to time here, apparently. Hmm. See, the problem is I don't know exactly where these are coming out of. It kind of just looks like they're randomly coming out of the walls. Not a, uh, not a huge fan of that. Oh, 
Off with the hedge! I'm on fire! Alright. Oh! Leg of meat! Yeah! Whoops, did uh, that was the uh, that was the wrong button. Um, uh, nothing else in here. Doesn't look like. Um, I'm guessing I have to get to the center of this whole thing. That's probably what I got to do. Oh, got him. RuneScape. Yeah. Um, again, this one in particular seems like it's... Uh, nobody really talks about this one. This one, I couldn't even find hardly anything about this individual port. Usually anything that I see about Rune, it's all just... Rune for the PC. And that's about it. Flame sword and let's just go ham. <sighs> nothing, nothing. Bioshock. Yeah, take two. Um, take two was kind of a big deal. Um, you know, they've been in a lot. Um, I probably needed to use that when I faced them right then, but it's, that, that is what it is. Oh, then that's the end. Alright, so that's that level. Cool. Oh, is that what that is? I, I don't know what figure take two and rockstar were two different things but okay that that's gotcha um all right so that was uh that was that level apparently Oh, yeah, well, exactly. But I don't know um, when Take Two took off, um, like when they were founded and and all that stuff. So I don't know, like, as far as what Take Two have ever published, where this game falls in. Again, it was, it was 2001 that they did this. Um, but it was already developed and this was just a port. So. Um, it was uh, Human Head Studios that was actually responsible for this game overall. Uh, Take Two just did the PS2 port, and that was about the extent of that. All right, yeah, you, that's right. You load from that eight megabyte memory card. I figured you were going to pop up eventually. Yeah. Come here, big guy. Oh, yeah. And no, I will take that. I think I lost that. Uh, well, I thought I was going to take that. Alright, I don't see myself using that. Can I pick this up now? I cannot. Uh. Oh, I actually did have it. It's just I must have had too many weapons. And it wouldn't let me switch. 
Oh, I thought this would switch out with my axe, and that's not the case. Well, this actually works a lot better than that mace does anyway. Legs of meat! Oh yeah, here we go. I will take that. Oh, pit mace. I did not realize that uh, that's what I was picking up. I thought I was getting this. Oh, what's up, fellas? Ooh! 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 Y'all have no chance against the pit mace, do ya? Ooh, that was neat. That was noise. That was real noise. Where the hell am I, and where am I going? Come here. He <laughs> All right, so, so far the pit mace is doing things for me. I will take that. This would be an indie game. Yeah, absolutely it would be. Yeah, six people developing a game? What is that? You know? Like, that ain't enough for nothing. Um... A lever or anything to do the thing? No? Aha. It's that obvious we need a blade for these guys. Because just, yeah, one shot off with their head, be done with it. Oh, didn't see you there. How you doing? Oh, here's a thing. There. Oh. Oh, come on. Okay, hold on. Oh! Oh! I, I see. I see. Come on. Die. your stink breath, okay? Why are you not wanting to die? So now when that one runs up to me, hits that lever. There we go. six guys and it looks infinitely more fun. Okay. This was made by six guys almost 25 years ago. <laughs> There's a little bit of a difference there. Oh, more hellhounds, huh? Um, actually, yeah, give me the new shield. I like that. I know. 
I mean, it, it deserves it. I mean, Sir Wolf Pass is fantastic, so... I mean, I'm all for that. Um... Well, what do you do? Well, you open gates. That's what you do. Well, at least there's some... <clears throat> I didn't want the mace. I wanted the lizards. Thank you very much. PS2 era of making game. Didn't have future tech. I mean, even with, you know, some of the limited things that they had back then, there's there's better games than this. <laughs> For sure there's better games than this. Uh, just, you know, some just definitely better than others. All right, you go down. Lizards? Oh, we got more of this. Ragnar, you fucking moron. Yep, I'll have that. I'll have that. I'll eat the leg of meat. Well, that's that's very true too. Oh, we're doing a thing. You see them, warrior? Odin will rule the day. He gave Not rue the day. His subjects. Now I send them to serve a new master. My father, Loki. Oh, so we're the dealing with the daughter of Loki. Of his allies will transform these walking husks into the tools of our revenge. Mm. So many new dead. So very, very many. Each hour marks the passage of a thousand more through these gates, thanks to that wonderfully bloodthirsty Conrack. Can you imagine the destruction, warrior? Can you see how Midgard will be ravaged once we have unleashed this horde? I mean... If Loki and the daughter of Loki are wanting to uh, wreak some havoc using all these, you know, damned dead soldiers, that's one hell of a way to do it. So they they got a little bit of a plan. They said, Odin's going to rue the day. She's thinking imminent ruage. And uh, I guess we're going to have to put a stop to that. Um, I'm still a little ways from hitting that. I, I still need, I believe, it's six more followers here on Twitch, and, um, gotta, gotta get my, um, average viewer count up a little bit, um, well, it's, it's, it's funny, because when I look at the thing, it says that my goal is 50, so it says 45, but if you actually look, like, on the profile, there's, like, 44, because one fell off some time ago, so I don't think that that other goal one reflected that um but either it's four or it's a uh, five or uh it's five or six you know followers that i still need and uh i need more consistent viewership for a while um so i mean it's getting there but still not quite i'm guessing this is uh the daughter of loki Toying with you, Ragnar. I shall divert a few souls from their march to Loki. Where you have conquered a small number, I now give you a legion. Soon you will fall, and you will join their ranks. Wonderful. Well, there's a leg of meat. We may need that here in a minute. 
All right, we're gonna have to switch weapons. Watch this, run and swipe. Run and swipe. <laughs> Thank you for that, by the way. <laughs> it would really help, guys. It would really help. All right. Um, it's looking as though that this game might not be able to process more than four enemies on screen because <laughs> I'm only seeing about four at a time. Flame sword. Oh, we got the blood lust going. Oh, yeah, bring it! Bring it! I shall mow thee down. How many more you got? Huh? How many? Hey, yo! Stick, man! <laughs> Thank you for that. <laughs> They're gonna rue the day they came up against the extreme. Wow, we uh, we're gonna keep doing this, huh? All right. So she ain't joking about a legion, huh? What is a legion of soldiers? Wasn't it like a thousand or something like that? Oh, we going we doing the bloodlust thing. Oh, there's another door or something open over there. That's the end of that. So yeah, that was just gonna keep going. Um, give her 
take a few hundred depending on the pr yeah huh All right. oh so we're on the elevator I kind of like that that's kind of neat I'll take a ride on the elevator Well, damn. How many levels are there to hell? I thought there was only like nine. Yeah, I mean, I'm so I'm I'm hoping to, you know, maybe one day to be able to get to affiliate. But at the same time, you know, um, if that never happens for me, it's cool too. It's not that big of a deal to me. Um, again, it would be neat, but um, I just I just do this for fun, and I appreciate having you guys here to, you know hang out and chat and that's that's really all it's about for me all the rest of the stuff doesn't really matter so much um if it comes it comes if it doesn't it doesn't it's fine you know no biggie get out of here skeletor um it would be neat to do before i get to some other big game because i got I've got some plans. I've got a few other series that I want to do. Things like that. But it would be nice to kind of build this up a little bit more before I do that. But, um, but you know, little here, little there, you know. I'll take that. That's a lesser rune. Or lesser power rune. I'll take that. I'm guessing I'm not supposed to just flop down there. Maybe I'm supposed to jump over there. Yeah, here we go. Ah, of course. Stink breath over here. Off with this head. Lizards? Alright, now we're to. Oh, hey, what up, guy? Goodbye. Here, maybe? No? Oh, I see. Okay. See, the little, like, platforming sections or whatever in this just feel so awkward. Okay, there we go. Oh, is that the elevator? Okay, yeah, I, but I don't quite understand what I'm looking at, though. Like, we're looking at it for a good second, but I don't know why we're looking at it. So let's see here. Secret passage? No. Maybe just this door, perhaps? No? Okay. I can't get to the chains to climb up those. Uh, that would be certain death. I will take that for sure. And a metal shield, I will take that also.
get out of here. Ugh. There we go. Say, hey, good grief. It's like uh, James Bond in 006, you know? It's like, why can't you just be a good boy and die? Well, where the hell am I at now? Yeah, like that guy did. He just completely gave up. Alright, I don't know what that did. Oh! I see. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay, I am getting so turned around. Well, that raised that. Whatever that did. That's not really telling me anything. There. Say, so just fucking die. What the hell we got going on here? All right, come here. Whatever. Come on. Come on, take his head off, will you? There, finally. Now, what are you? Anything? The, apparently, you're nothing. So that's, uh, that's all kinds of cool. This was apparently a dead end. I can't reach that in order to see if I can try to climb it for one reason or another. So apparently that was nothing but a waste of my time. Alright, let's try this way. Bye. And I'm gonna die. Well, maybe not. Okay. Well, let's get the hell off of this thing. Um, steps. Steps should lead to somewhere good. You knock it off! One talking to you. And button.
cool. Hey, I think we made it. <laughs> that must have been the uh, elevator. Uh, source. Okay. Continuing on. I think we're getting somewhere here. Oh, looks like we might finally be out of hell. My loading screen has changed. So, oh, and I see on the side here, on the right side, there what looked like a rune at the bottom. I just thought that was a symbol. Well, there's another symbol at the top. Looks like a, a castle or something of some kind. And the lines here must be like my route. So that must be kind of... I'm trying to head up to the castle? I don't know. It, and it really is. It, like, the <laughs> It's like it's having to load so much stuff, they have to break it up into such smaller inc uh, increments, which is kind of blowing my mind. Please wait. Yeah, like I have a choice. All right. So, yeah, look, I think we finally got out of hell. Ah, there we go. It is no simple thing to withstand Hell's treachery in her own domain. You have proven your mettle, brave warrior. Remember what you have seen and heard in that place, for it will serve you well in your quest. You now enter the caverns beneath the Tyrdal Mountains. Beware. For you will find its denizens as numerous as Hell's thralls, and unencumbered by rotting flesh. Excellent. Uh, okay. Now what to do, where to go. You do nothing, apparently. Nothing around here for me, anywhere. No, apparently not. Alright, just find the exit and go. <laughs> More skeletons? Yeah, yeah, that's uh, probably a pretty fair guess. Oh, shut up. Nothing over there. No idea what those things are. They don't look like rats. They don't look... I, I don't... I don't know. I have no idea. No, my shield is still better. So all of that is for nothing. Fine, give me the lizard. Well, no wonder uh, Odin there was saying something about, you know, in her own domain and everything. That that makes sense. There is nothing over here for me, so... Uh, excuse me, what?
What the hell was that all about? I guess I wanted to go swimming. Sure. Find a way to climb back up. Is that uh, the whole thing now? Think, stupid plant looking thingamajig. Neat. If I was supposed to go here either because that didn't really take me anywhere that did nothing for me ah here we are yeah there we go now we're getting somewhere I think Break down the walls! <laughs> Alright, where am I and what am I doing? I guess, uh, downwards. It's a pretty safe thing to assume, I suppose. Well, you suck, whatever you are. Further down? Well, I can't go that way. Go this way? Uh, why am I getting that notification? I don't need that in my life right now. I can go no further that way. So what, down here? out of here oh okay yeah we're we're going places what the hell is that looks like an evil Venus flytrap what the hell is that okay so We've got we've got that now. Wonderful. Ow. I will take that. Absolutely I will. I will not because I am actually full on that meter. So uh that's a thing. Oh, well, that must have been the end of that level. Cool. Yeah, I, again, I love when you walk through a door or just drop off a ledge and before the feet even land. Oh, do you want to save now? You're you're done with that one, by the way. Um, just, just so you're aware. You might want to save it here, just in case. You know, may have just fallen to his death. We don't know. He didn't get to land, so we don't know what happened. It, it really does. It seems like just... Uh, it throws me so off guard. Like, I'm expecting them to land and to be able to keep going, and... No. Hey, do you want to save now? Just thought we'd ask. You know. We just wanted to make sure. You haven't saved in a good minute. Yeah. Load from that point. It's like, alright, well, I'm going to continue this game and then just fall. Like, oh, I don't know what just happened. <laughs> Saving jump scare. <laughs> Yeah, that would that would just be so awkward. I don't know of any other game that does that. Not one. 
Not one that I can think of, anyway. There may be other games that do that, but... None that are coming to mind right now. Let's see, look, yeah, just random fall. Like, if I would have saved this, say, hey guys, this is the end of the stream, I'm done. Come back Tuesday night, hit continue, and then just fall. Like, oh, I guess that's, um... That's where I'm at, just falling. That's, that's what we're doing. Over a body of water as soon as the load of the game got eaten by a shark. Yeah, well, then at that point, you would be, uh... In that constant state, then, wouldn't you? Like, that'd be, uh... <clears throat> one of those things that was uh, gonna be a loop. You wouldn't be able to get out of that, right? Unless you just had to load from a different save prior to that. Let's see my new save and load screen. Okay. That's, uh. That feels awkward. And why does it seem like, okay, I just got out of hell. And now, I'm descending further down again. Why is that a thing? underwater section. Just what I wanted. Because I love underwater sections so much. I have no idea what is happening right now. Get me on solid ground, will you please? I would have no idea what if just regular weapons would work on them, or what's going on with that? What the hell are you? Oh, just the severed head. Sure. That's just gonna keep attacking that, so that's cool. <laughs> All right, um, gonna get away from there. Climb up, you? I can. And I was say what? And you led to nowhere? Is that what I'm getting at here? And I can't. Okay. Oh, I gotta do the jump across the vine thing, which is really dumb in this game. It feels awkward. Oh, well, that is beyond cool. <clears throat> You want to talk about the draw distance, like, in older games, like, look at this, just fog everywhere, can't see anything. Alright, uh, I guess... Wait, can I not... Can I not grab that? Is that not a thing? That apparently is not a thing. <clears throat> cool. Even better. Say, we just don't... Don't fall down there, alright? Please. No, you can fall down there, though. That's... That's totally cool!
What, I swim all the way around here for nothing, is that it? That's, uh, that's even cooler yet. Like, there's no splashing animation or nothing, you hear that? Like, it's just so dull. Alright. Will you... Will you stupid ass? Grab... Grab the thing, will you? Please. Please. I beg you. Oy. All right, back over here again. I can go nowhere that way. So the only place it looks like I can go would be over here, but he don't want to grab the thing. Ah, there we go. Just got to stand on the flower in order to do it. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> this, tell you, this game, man, definitely feels janky. Eat that lizard. Eat that. I'll eat that lizard. Eat the hell out of that lizard. Those stupid things? About tired of dealing with those already. Uh, Ups a daisy some more? No, that's, that's where I just came up here at. So that served me no purpose. So I must have missed something this way? Do I gotta go that way? Is that it? Well, this just takes me around in a circle, so that uh, appears... <clears throat> that appears to be the thing. No, that's, uh, that's totally cool. Let me do all of that all over again. Good grief. Alright. You know, I said something earlier about, like, the combat not feeling great, and it doesn't. Don't get me wrong. Combat in this game feels kind of terrible. But I'll take more of the combat all day long at, uh, 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 besides doing whatever the hell this is. Um, because this just doesn't feel good at all. Oh, there it is again. Just drop off the edge of the cliff and, oh, you're done with that chapter now. <laughs> God, that, is just, that is just so weird. I don't like it. I hate when that happens like that. Okay. Uh, I mean, making progress, though. I guess that's, I guess that's the whole thing. I guess that's all I can really say is at least progress is being made. <clears throat> kind of hoping to be able to get out of wherever the hell this is under these mountains or whatever Odin said <clears throat> sooner rather than later cuz i'm already thinking that i'm not liking this i'm liking this less than the last place that i just left and hell's supposed to be pretty damn bad Let's screen simulator <laughs> thanks lurk appreciate you stopping by and uh 
hanging out, chatting for a while. It's always greatly appreciated. It means a lot. And uh, we will uh, we'll see you next time, my friend. There. This could explain some of the misty drawn distance. Um, maybe. <clears throat> I suppose that's possible. Look at you, you big son of a bitch. What's over there? Anything? Anything worth trying to get over there? It doesn't... It doesn't look like it. So I guess... We'll just continue this way, I suppose. That is actually the wrong button. That is not what I meant to do. <clears throat> well, I can't even take those. And I guess that's all that was under here, so... That's disappointing. Would, uh, would have liked to have had those. Um, nowhere else to go up here, I guess. So now we gotta figure out what the hell to do next. Oh, more underwater. That's exactly what I wanted in my life. Um, well, I guess I wanted to go that way. What the f the, that's, uh, that's not cool. I don't appreciate that. Oh, and I can go... I got Niente that way. Say swim up. Was that really that entire level? That right there? Really? Oh, let me guess. That was the Deep Guardian. Is what we saw there. Gotcha. <laughs> you know about that niente? That level was practically niente. There wasn't a whole lot to it. <clears throat> Next level, guys. That took a whole 30 seconds. You see what I mean? Like, there's supposedly like 70 different save points. That one took what felt like less than a minute. It may have been 60 seconds. Oh, and my screen changed again. So now I've got a. Now we're at Planet of the Apes, apparently. What well, it looks like. Oh boy. <clears throat> it's like. Wh where, where are we going? Are we facing off with Loki and, like, his army of the dead? Or are we f facing jellyfish? Are we facing. Are we facing the apes? What. What. Exactly, are we doing, Mr. Viking Warlord, sir? Please wait. Uh, please wait. Yeah, don't don't worry. I got no problem with that. And what the hell are you? Hold on. Wait. Hold on. Yeah, there there actually are creature uh, a creature list in the manual. You know, the good old manuals. What you know about those? 
Um, okay, so what we just saw, that creature, that <laughs> that's their version of a goblin, apparently. So that's a that's a thing. Um So yeah, we got goblins now. Nice. <sighs> sure. No, I wanted to go swimming. That's fine. Um So, none of that is anything. Well, replenish my health, I guess. I guess I can do that, I suppose. Always have the full health, when it ever possible. Uh, onward! These goblins don't want none of me. I'm telling you. About to find that out right now. So I thought. Touche game. I was, uh, I was not expecting that. Yeah, you, you caught me off guard there a little bit. Check and shit! Come here, goblin. Okay. About to go AJ Styles out. Yeah, they don't want none. The good old new manual smells. Yeah, you don't get that anymore. I kind of miss that, to be honest. Yay! <laughs> What the hell was that? Oh, not rolling that bad. Yeah? Oh, I have no shield now. Yeah, no more shield. That sucks. Uh, fall down there? Probably not a great idea. And, uh, yeah, they, uh, they took half of my health right then. That's, uh, that's not ideal. Although, I will take that leg of meat. Oh, you trapped me. Get out of here. Get out of here. <sighs> All right. Uh, note to self, can't walk on the ledge or uh, walk on the branch. That's uh that is not a thing. All right. End of the level? Nope, not quite. <laughs> I expected that to be the end right then. They just kill one of their own? Is that is that what just happened? Uh Geronimo. Apparently. Look at you, you dumb bastard! You got no arms left! 
Nicely done, I must say. Lizard. Lizard. You just fell to your death? No, you're over here now. Um, I'm not sure if I'm heading in the right direction. Apparently, I am because things are happening. Is that another elevator? Don't even tell me I'm going back down where I came from. That would be silly. Something else is happening. Just getting ambushed, I, I take it. That's that's what's gonna be happening here. Uh yep, ambush is coming. Health is running a little on the low side. Not a fan of that. Tunes, man. I mean, I really wouldn't go back down here, right? Well, maybe apparently I will. No, say I wouldn't think that would be a thing. That wouldn't have made a whole lot of sense. Oh boy. Oh, look at all the lizards. Yup, thank you. Health. Health. Needed all of that. And drop down to my death again, where apparently I can save it. <clears throat> See, that was, uh, was it Goblin's Watch. So, in the first stream... I got through, I'll call them, like, 12 save points. 
That was Goblin's Watch. So I've got, if I get three more, which I should be able to, I should be able to stay on point uh, with that same 12. And uh, I can kind of start getting an idea how many more streams this is going to take me in order to get through this. Looks like um, we're getting closer to uh, the castle up there. So that's got to be something, right? Theoretically, that should be something. You know, keep looking at that message there about the, you know, the manuals, the new manual smells, but the, just the manuals themselves. You know, going back and buying old games like I have been doing... With the exception of, like, your cartridge-based games, right? Because the cartridge-based games, a lot of that stuff, the boxes and all that stuff, all that stuff kind of got thrown out. So the cartridge-based games, and I'm talking, like, Nintendo, the SNES, the N64, those kind of things, you don't really end up having the manuals, usually. You tried to be sneaky, you little bastard. Um, but for, uh, disc-based games, I, uh, I really try to, uh, you know, get stuff that's complete in box. I just like to have, you know, the, uh, complete, the complete thing. Well, this feels awkward. Um, it's like, oh yeah, you know, I want the complete inbox <clears throat> things, um, but like hardly ever look at any of the manuals for anything that I have. <laughs> Actually, this was a thing. If I jump here, yeah. I don't know where I can jump to. Oh. There's a, like a rope there. Okay. Oh, this all feels dumb. Ow! Alright, can't go that way. Which way can I go? That way? I suppose I would have jumped from there to there, and then I could have got that, but I don't really want that that badly. Oh, neat! <sighs> okay, yeah, that was the thing. Well, then where in the he- Oh. More underwater crap. Just what I wanted. Just what I needed in my life, guys, really. What the f- Wait. What purpose does that serve? That I can go here and it leads to nothing? Well, that's, uh... That's really dumb. Maybe that was just a trap, but... Yeah, 
That leads to nothing. So... This doesn't take me anywhere, right? No? Well... Then this doesn't take me anywhere, right? No. So... Why can I come here? Looks like I could go up there somewhere, but that also doesn't look to be the case. Um. Yeah, I don't. Uh, I don't know. This seems awfully pointless. this way. Yeah, this whole area may have been for nothing, because I think there was a different way that I could go. So, yeah, maybe that was all for nothing. Essentially. Because I can... Which way did I come from? I might have came from up here. I don't... I don't know for sure. Well, here's things that I haven't beaten yet, so that's that's got to mean something, I suppose. Well, all right. So I guess that was that. Oh, I got one of their shields. Uh, that's cool, I guess. I didn't realize I can pick up their shields. Or I would have been doing that a long time ago. Oy. What? And then that was all that was up here too? So where... Where the hell am I supposed to be going then? Well, that was awesome. I am so confused. How did I even get here in the first place? I almost feel like this is a door that I should be able to go through. And for some reason I can't. But then I can come down here, but for what reason? Duh! <clears throat> go further down. Further down. 
<sighs> okay. What the hell just happened? <laughs> I I don't I don't know, but we're just we're just gonna roll with it, I guess. Okay, sure. Goblin shield. All right, now where the hell am I at? Bye-bye. <clears throat> we got more rope climbing. Is that is that what's going on here? Get out of here. I'm trying to look around, man. Yeah, that that looks like that's what's going on, so. So stand here. Woo, that was, uh, that was weird. Um, it's, it's feeling confusing. I'm, I swear, it's, I don't really know what, what the hell is going on or exactly where I'm going. I'm kind of just faking it till I make it kind of thing right now. Oh, hey. Coming over here pretty fast. How you doing? I wasn't done eating lizards. Will you leave me alone? No. Nope. Fuck your goblin axe. Lizard. Lizard. I... That I don't know either. When it first gave me the little tutorial thing... At the beginning, you were eating legs of meat. You know, like... Big... Like, chicken bone looking things. And now it's... Yeah, I don't know. It's... Ever since the game started, it's been all lizards. Goblin axe. Well, goblin axe might do some damage. Hell, I don't know. Let's see what a goblin axe does against the goblins, huh? Or maybe we won't do that, because that's not the weapon he pulled out. You little bastard. Oh, there's the goblin axe. Earthquake! Oh yeah, then there's these things. Boing! Ooh. Ooh. Alright, note to self, the axe seems to work better against the goblins than the sword does. What the f what the hell is that? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Oh, here we go again. Where's that going to shoot me to though? I don't know. Oh, way up here? Neat.
That just feels awkward, too. 69% accurate? Vikings jumping on trampolines? I believe it. Look at his legs, though. Did you see what he was doing with his legs? Like, he's, like, doing, like, the crisscross and everything while he's flying through the air. Just so awkward. Like, why? Why would they give him that in that animation for that? Oh, uh, neat. Did I die? Is that what happened? I think I died. Maybe? Well, if that was the case, then this, this wouldn't be continuing, I wouldn't think. To you too. Save game. I I guess that was supposed to happen. So we'll uh we're just gonna roll with that. So that was uh into the pit. So alright. Uh cool. It's like everything that happens in this game, like, the combat just doesn't feel the greatest, but then when anything else happens in this game, it just feels awkward. It just, it doesn't have a decent flow to it. Every other little animation, anytime something happens, falling through the floor, or uh, going from, like, the one loading screen to another, it, awkward time. It just, just, the whole thing just feels off. Like... It just seemed like, and but again, I don't know what the original PC version is like. Maybe the PC version is like this too. I mean, it's, again, it's a game from 2000, but it just seems like it lacks polish. Like there's something missing. Cool. I'm uh, I'm in a, a cage, dangling over things now. So that's cool. That's fun. are you? Well, I have no weapons now, so that's fun. Oh, there's a short sword, but I can't imagine I'm going to do a whole lot against that beast like this. Like Monty Python, run away! Well, I got a waterlogged shield. Whatever good that's going to do for me. How about we just get the hell away from this? How, how about that? Uh, I can get through this wall. For whatever that's worth. Ugh, get away from me! Uh, well, his... His quest was well. There's there was another Viking. Nay, uh, what the hell is his name? Um, there's might it might say in the manual what his name was. There's a there was another Viking towards the beginning that. Uh, kind of ruin things for everybody. 
Um. Um. Let's see here. They just mentioned him earlier too. Um, yeah, I'm not seeing it in here even, but, um, anyways, there was a, a different Viking at the beginning who basically, um, is basically telling Odin to go screw himself and is siding with Loki and was going to bring a, um, use Loki's powers gifted to him by Loki to bring forth Ragnarok to free Loki, uh, and then basically s start taking over the world. Um, our character, Ragnar, oh, uh, was then res- well, this other guy, This other guy used some of Loki's power to basically kill all of your clansmen, your father, you, uh, and uh, sink your longship. And in doing so, sent you to hell. Well, Odin uh, then resurrects you. And you basically work for Odin uh, on this quest to try to stop this other Viking from bringing forth Ragnarok uh, to keep Loki from showing up. That's what I got out of it anyways. Um, so it's all about stopping this other Viking from bringing forth the end of the world. Okay, well... Oh, well, I couldn't have went any further that way if I wanted to, so... So now I'm going in circles. That's awesome. No, I need you to jump when I tell you to jump, guy. Are you serious? Wait, where the hell am I at now? No, I need to go here. What, the original Unreal Engine? Ah, there we go. Got it that time. Not that that mattered. I can't go anywhere this way anyway. So, where the hell am I supposed to be going? I don't... I don't know. I gotta get up there, but how? I see nowhere else for me to jump and climb here. So... I gotta be able to f go up still somewhere. I'm not gonna go that way anywhere. And I can't go that way. <sighs> All right, 
Okay, so now, once again, I am lost. Not sure where I'm supposed to go. Can't go anywhere that way. The... From... From what I understand, the PC version got decent reviews. <clears throat> PS2 version, not so much. And that's from what I had seen. Well, here I am, I'm here again, but I'm just, I'm just going in circles. I'm just going in circles at this point. Oh, go to hell. Yeah, and here I'm back here again. So... What am I supposed to do? Ah, well, I'm, uh, I'm glad I swung at that, because that, I would have not, I would not have guessed that at all. It still didn't seem like it was going to help me, though. Fifteen people? Well, that's, uh, something, I guess, huh? Actually, give me... We need the Bone Club back. We want that. Well, I still can't get up there. Well, there went my axe, so that was, uh, that was neat. Yeah, I can't jump up. Oh, what the hell. All right. Uh, was uh, unaware that this down here was a thing, so I'm down here now. I guess. I love winding up places that I didn't even know were a thing. That's just great, you know? Well, I'm down here. How do I get the hell out of here? That's the next question. Oh. Here? Yeah, here, I guess. Okay, I don't know how I did it. I don't know where I went. But I wound up somewhere. I'll take it. Oh, well the thing just shoved me off the cliff. So that's neat. But apparently that's where I was supposed to go. Cool. <laughs> oh, you know, when I knocked... Okay, let me think about this. When I swung and hit the rock, knocked it over, it must have made the crack in the floor, which is then how I got in there and then got out. I don't know if that's exactly what happened, but that makes sense to me, so that's what I'm going to go with. I'll, I'll justify it that way. Ragnar's Flight. Whatever the hell that means. Is it because I fell off the cliff? Decided to fly off the cliff? Neat. <laughs> cool.
<clears throat> All right. Got a couple more levels. If I can knock out a couple more, then I should be able to stay on point. At least where I try to get to. What the hell is this? Oh, I'm riding the thing. We get a flying level now? Is that what's is that, is that what's happening? Listen to that jam. Look at Ragnar just taming this giant beetle and flying the hell out of there. Yeah, this um this took a turn I was not expecting. Okay, so that was just a cutscene. <laughs> Neat. Um, which that's that was probably fine. To be completely honest, uh, I uh, I don't think I would have wanted to try to control that anyway. With as janky as this game feels at times, if that would have been a legitimate level, uh, that that may have broke me, and I probably would have said, you know what, guys, I'm I'm done done with this game. There will be no continuation of this. <laughs> Alright, we are now on Snowy Approach. Um, so yeah. So we got our uh, ship sank. We went to hell. Fought our way out of hell. Resurrected by Odin. Uh, had to fight these goofy looking crabs. Then a sad excuse for a goblin. Uh, then we got to ride on a giant insect, and now, um, well, our line has now gone all the way to the castle, so it looks like maybe a, uh, maybe a village or something of some kind? Um, I, I don't know. I don't know anymore. I'm not 100% sure what's going on. You see, and that's the thing, like, when I went to try to find a level list for this PS2 version, I couldn't do it. I had to go and find somebody else on YouTube that played this, and I didn't watch any of it, because I didn't want to give any of it away for myself, but I just kind of scrolled through, and each time I saw a save point in his playthrough, I just, you know, typed it out on, you know, my list, and that way I had an idea, and there was 70 of those that I came across. So... Yeah, some of those just take place before and after cutscenes, and so they're not actual levels per se. It just, um, oh no! Oh, he already died. Oh, who here has seen Dragon Ball Z abridged? Cause I just thought of Nappa right then. It's like it's dead, Nappa. Ah, oh, I remember when we first got him, Vegeta. And yeah, he's he's dead already. Aw. As I foretold, you have won your way to the surface, and before you lies the mountain fortress of Thorstadt. Thorstadt. Darkness lies inside those walls. Conrack. As does Conrack. And vengeance for your father's death. Yeah, Andy! <laughs> yeah, I thought of that one too. Alright, Conrack. That's the guy's name. Goofy ass name. Oh, where the hell am I going?
That looks like death if I go down there. Uh... I think that's where I do have to go, though. There's no other way, it looks like. Uh, no. <laughs> that is, in fact, not the case. <laughs> cool. Um, I don't remember for certain, but that may be my first death tonight, as stupid as that was. Note to self, I need to find another way. I don't know, to be fair though, I just got a message from Odin. Also maybe partly figure if I drop down in this bottomless pit, that was another save point. You never know with this game, you know? You just kind of have to take your chances every once in a while because you never know when it's just going to save the game mid-drop. <laughs> that wasn't one of them. Okay, let's, uh, let's try that again. As I foretold, you have won your way to the surface, and before you lies the mountain fortress of Thorstadt. Darkness lies inside those walls, as does Conrak, and vengeance for your father's death. That's cool and everything? Can, uh, you know, Mr. Allfather there build me a damn bridge to the place or something? You know? Give me something that I can work with? Oh. Here? I don't know. Felt like that was kind of lucky. Oh, now we have the Yeti! It's the Yeti! Suave what you know about the Yeti. I know you know about the Yeti. Alright, well. Onward. Oh, here. Okay. There we go. Um, yeah, I'm I'm guessing not. I don't know. I try to remember some of these you know, older games as I'm going through them. Like, okay, if I put myself... Um... Back to the year 2000 or whenever... Uh, any other game it is that I'm playing was released. Like, okay, how good of would this have been? Like, would this have been a great game back then? Or... You know, was this even bad by, like those standards because I don't really know that's still the wrong button here we go leg of meat I got full health who is so. that who is what is returning. He is upon us. oh you're getting slaughtered my guys. Blaze! Oh, that was cool. <laughs> that 
That was cool. All right, so this uh, this axe has that blaze feature, and uh, that's uh, that's dope. Oh, all right, cool. Roman sword again, the goblin axe again. The shield I have still must be pretty good. Where do you think you're going? Huh? Where do you think you're going? Unlimited throw! I thought that was supposed to be unlimited throw! <laughs> the hell happened to my unlimited throw? I threw it and I didn't even have it to throw. <laughs> I obviously did not do that right. Oh, I'm sure. You know, when you had games like... I think Suave and I were talking about it Tuesday night. That when you had games also coming out in 2001, like Metal Gear Solid 2, um, this on the PS2 uh, didn't stand a chance. Oh, well, that's... All right, cool. Yeah, that's the, uh, that's the end of that level, guys. Uh, got another one. So that was Snowy Approach. I might have a chance to maybe get through one more. Uh, and then I'll call it. I should call it now. I am I am pretty much right at my time. But I feel like if it's short, which most of these do feel pretty short, if I can get to where I'm supposed to go, I should be able to get through one more. They do, too. It's just it's so abrupt and... I don't care how much of this game I play, and even if I get through the entire thing, I don't think I'm ever going to get used to that. It's just, um, all right, step, 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 up, oh, done, safe, up, uh, up, oh, sure. It just, I don't know. Even if, even if you were into a section of the game, right, and you know you actually were feeling it, kind of into it, it just. The, those abrupt endings and save spots they they just kill the momentum that you're trying to build or any kind of momentum the game was having at all it just it just abrupt stop and then it just then continue again it's just so awkward Retention, retention, it may be. You dare to trespass against a god? And who might that be? Because that ain't you. <laughs> <laughs> Trespass against a god, huh? Yeah, you got a funny way of thinking about a god. Oh, oh, didn't realize I could go in here. Fat Man 4000, how you doing? Good to see ya. Uh, no, don't grab the rope, Ragnar. I would just rather you not. You know? Alright, what is down here, anyway? Bone club. I will take that. Goblin shield. That axe I must already have. Yep, that's that axe right there. So, all right. Yeah, give me that. 
Doing good? It's good to hear. I'm glad. Thanks for uh, stopping by, hanging out. What in the hell? Well. Avalanche. The man that got crushed by a giant boulder. <laughs> Instantaneous death. Uh, all right, so let's sit through that uh, two-minute loading screen again. Now, that's uh, that's fine. Oh, well, that sucks. To, you know, have an, uh, you know, some kind of an appointment or something like that, and whoever you're waiting for doesn't show up, man, that's a complete waste of your time, right? Because you could have done anything else with that time and with your day. I hate it when people do stuff like that. Alright, let's try this one more time. And see if we can't get Ragnar crushed again. You dare to trespass against a god? Just... just die. Well, that shield must still be fine, so that's that. Yeah, see if we can't get Ragnar crushed again. Looks like we survived that. I think we're good. Alright. Hell am I at now? Gonrak has made his seat a haven of corruption and decadence. Mr. Odin. From his followers' worship of the dark gods. Seek the betrayer within the temple of Loki and strike your blow for vengeance. Yes, sir. All oh, Father. in there. So vengeance will be mine. Look at the lowland wreckage that has washed up against our wall. It's a sorry sight. I'll call out the guard and disturb great Sigurd. I'll handle this one myself. Oh, you will, huh? Let's see about that. Where are you running? Where are you running? Oh, uh, well, now he's the man that got crushed by a giant boulder. 
Ooh, is that a new- Oh, the Viking Axe! Oh, hell yeah! Oh, yeah! Drank some mead! I think that's the first bit of mead I've been able to drink all game. Yeah, you know what? Now we got the Viking Axe, and we drank some mead. Means we're ready to kick some serious ass. Oh, uh, I appreciate that. I I don't have, unfortunately, a whole lot longer to go. I was actually, once I get to the end of this level, going to be calling it for the night. Um, but, oh, they opened the door for me at least. Um, so, yeah, I, I don't have too much longer to go tonight, unfortunately. But I do appreciate you stopping by and checking the stream out. Um, and even though I have played much better games, I have played much worse games. So, as of right now, I still intend on returning to this again next Tuesday night. And uh, continuing with part three. Um, that might be against my better judgment, but that's currently the plan. No, give me my Viking axe back. Oh, you've been watching a little bit already? Okay. Okay, well, I can come down here, but for why? Oh, well, I can come up here. So I guess that's a thing. To be able to break all that stuff, but you never get anything out of them. So developers, why is that a thing exactly? Oh, well, that's... Uh, Alright. Yeah, that's the, uh, that's the end of that level. I fall again, and that's the end. Well, um... So, that even was, uh... Just pass. Um... So, I got through at least one extra level, so... Um, that, that's not terrible. And I'm on Thorstot's Gates. So, um, yeah, one extra level, that's, uh, that's not terrible. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that again. I don't, I, I probably did just save it, but I just, my mind's elsewhere, and yeah, so that's, that's fine. Um... So, getting through one more extra level than what I planned on tonight, that helps. And it sounds like we are at the doorstep of uh, taking on Conrack uh, in the Temple of Loki. So, that, that could be a cool place to uh, start off with come the next stream next Tuesday night. So that's that seems like it's a good place to stop anyway. It seems like it would be like possibly getting towards end game in a way cuz Conrack is the whole thing that you're supposed to be, you know, he's the guy you're supposed to be taking revenge on. He's the guy you're supposed to be stopping. You would think that it's like, "Oh, I might be getting towards the end." Uh but no. And there's like 70 different save points. And, uh, that was only 25. <laughs> so, um, nowhere close to endgame yet. Who is that? <laughs> Who is that? Just got your ass kicked. Oh, we got some armor and stuff now. Look at Ragnar go. 
So he's starting to turn into the Viking warlord, it looks like. Um, but yeah, that's where this one is, uh, that we're gonna call it tonight. That's, uh, that's about my time. Um, I appreciate everybody, you know, stopping by, hanging out, chatting. Um, so I'll try to remember everybody here. So we had, of course, Fat Man, thanks for, uh, stopping by. Evolving Fetus for hanging out and chatting all night. Um, Squirrel, Squirrels Gaming was here, appreciate you. Lurk was here for quite a while, appreciate you. And, uh, Suave, uh, of course, as always, I appreciate you being here and, um, checking this out and, uh, chatting with us most of the night. Uh, again, uh, for anybody who hasn't done it already by now, check out that, uh, Grim Beardson Discord and then you can catch Suave Beardson streams, uh, Wednesday and Sunday. Sunday, Suave, what do you have going on? I don't, I don't remember. You did a speed run Wednesday. What is your plan for Sunday currently? I don't remember. Oh, you know what? No, I think I remember now. But I want to be sure. Ancestors, the Humankind Odyssey. That's right. That one will be interesting, uh, especially even for myself to to check out and watch. I've heard of the game. I don't really know much about it. I've never seen any gameplay from it or nothing. So this coming up Sunday, st uh, stop by, check out Swab Beardson as he starts Ancestors, the Humankind Odyssey. And then come right back here next Tuesday night where we will continue with part three of Rune Viking Warlord on the PlayStation 2. And until then, thanks again, everybody. I appreciate you. I'm D. I'm the Grim Gamer. And we'll see you next time.